Hey guys, welcome to Cora Radar, your one-stop shop for tips and tricks in the digital world. Today we'll talk about how to fix iPhone update error 4000. So, you receive an error 4000 when trying to update your iPhone with iTunes on a computer. This is a common problem you may encounter during the update process and it failed. It'll pop up a dialog box saying the iPhone could not be updated. An unknown error occurred, 4000. No guidance is given to fix the error code except for a more information and OK option. If you now want to remove the iPhone error 4000 and continue the update process, you'll need to identify and fix the root problem. First of all, what does error code 4000 mean? iPhone update error code 4000 is also called iTunes error 4000 by most Apple users. It often occurs after iTunes finishes downloading the software update and planning to install it to your device. There is no official document to explain what code 4000 is on iTunes. According to an expert's review in Apple discussion, the update error means that the connection between the iPhone and iTunes was interrupted in the middle of an update activity. Next, what's the cause of an update error 4000 on iPhone? The error 4000 iPhone cannot be updated unknown error has occurred message doesn't offer specific details for us to spot the culprits. So, there are a lot of reasons behind this issue including a flaky USB port, an antivirus or a firewall, an out-of-date iTunes, software glitches on the iPhone itself, and so on. The iTunes error code 4000 can also happen when there is a bug in iTunes for Windows that requires the phone to be unlocked during the update, although that's less common. Getting back to the point, follow me to learn how to fix iPhone update error code 4000 by trying the troubleshooting steps below. Don't worry if you're a novice of digital devices or a new iPhone user. We'll introduce all the methods step by step, making it easy to fix iOS update glitch on iPhone. Besides, if you have any questions, write it down in the comment below and we'll reply to you within 24 hours. Update iTunes to its latest version. The iTunes on your Mac or PC might not work with the latest iOS version. That's why your iTunes keeps giving you an error code 4000 during the iOS update. So, the very first thing you need to do is to update iTunes. Follow these steps. Open iTunes on your computer. If you're using a Mac, click on iTunes in the top left corner of the screen. If you're using a Windows PC, click on Help in the top menu. Select Check for Updates. If an update is available, follow the prompts to download and install the latest version of iTunes. After installing the latest version of iTunes, Try to use it to update your iPhone and see if error code 4000 appears in iTunes again. Hopefully not. Switch a USB cable or a different USB's port on your computer. If the connection between your iPhone and iTunes is at fault, you should verify if the USB cable or USB's port is working well. Firstly, check if the USB cable can charge your iPhone. If not, change another cord. Next. Insert a USB or any external device to the USB's port and see if it can detect the device. If not, switch to another USB's port that works. Once you're assured that the USB cable and USB's port are both in good condition, do an update with iTunes again. This time, make sure to keep your iPhone unlocked during the process. There's a possibility that a locked phone will also prevent iTunes from updating iPhone software, rendering error 4000 in iTunes. So, keep your phone unlocked. If needed, disable the passcode lock before you do the update. Update iOS in iPhone Settings app. If you still see iTunes saying the error message the iPhone could not be updated. An unknown error occurred. 4000. Try updating the device over the air. It's always easy to go to the Settings app right on your phone and download and install an update there. To update your iPhone using the Settings app, you can follow these steps. Make sure your iPhone is connected to a Wi-Fi network. Open the Settings app, tap on General, select Software Update. If an update is available, tap Download and Install. Enter your passcode if prompted, then follow the on-screen instructions to complete the update process. This is a safe and easy way to solve the error code 4000 while updating iPhone. Restart iPhone to clear system cache. Overloaded system cache also tends to halt the connection between your iPhone and iTunes. To fix error code 4000 message on iPhone due to the system cache, restart your device. If you're using an iPhone 10, 11, or later iPhone models, do this to restart your iPhone. Press and hold the volume up or down button and the side button until the power off slider appears. 
Drag the slider to the right and wait 30 seconds for your device to turn off. To turn your device back on, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. If you're using an iPhone 8 or older iPhone models, do this to restart your iPhone. Press and hold the side button until the power off slider appears. Drag the slider to the right and wait 30 seconds for your device to turn off. To turn your device back on, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. Then, charge your iPhone and make sure that it has 80% battery power at least. At the same time, confirm that there is at least 6 GB memory space available to do an update. Once you're ready, do an update through iTunes again and see if you stop iPhone saying error 4000 when updating now. Update iOS via recovery mode. Yes, this is also a way recommended by Apple to update your iPhone, but it's a little bit complicated. If there is no recent update available on the settings app and you still have can't update iPhone error 4000 problem, just give this a try. Run iTunes or Finder on your computer. Use a USB cable to connect your iPhone to a computer. Depending on your iPhone model, you'll need to follow different steps to enter recovery mode. For iPhone 8 and later models, press and quickly release the volume up button, then press and quickly release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side button until the recovery mode screen appears. For iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, press and hold the volume down button and the side button simultaneously until the recovery mode screen appears. For iPhone 6s and earlier models, press and hold the home button and the side or top button simultaneously until the recovery mode screen appears. Once your iPhone is in recovery mode, iTunes or Finder will detect it and prompt you to update or restore your device. Choose the update option to download and install the latest available iOS version. The process might take a very long time, but it's worth it. Once done, let your iPhone restart. Now, you resolve the update error 4000 and iPhone is running the most recent iOS version. And there you have it, folks. We've reached the end of our video on how to fix iPhone update error 4000. Thank you for watching and we wish you the best of luck in getting your iPhone back in working condition. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel for more tech-related content. Until next time.